ejike um, your majesty you know in our tradition a son succeeds the father and now that your son is no more <clears throat> what are your plans or the next move in getting whom succeeds you on the throne Igwe, <laughs> what he's trying to say is that it's uh, that you have to marry a young lady, a young girl who will bear us a son, who will ascend the throne when you might have joined our ancestors, please. Thank you very much. Um, I have heard you. <laughs> Your Majesty, so... You will give it a thought. I have heard you. You know, the elders think I should get married to a second wife so I can get an heir to this throne. But I'm not even thinking about that. You see, we are Roman Catholics and I don't think there's a need for me to take a second wife, no. None whatsoever, no. But my king, that seems to be our only option. If we know we will not be losing this throne, I can't conceive anymore because of age. You see, this is why I love you very much, because of your understanding. Very few women would encourage their husbands to take a second wife, but I will not take a second wife. No. You see, taking a second wife is not really a guarantee that I can get an heir to this throne. Remember, Henry VIII broke away from the Catholic Church because he wanted a son after his wife had given him Elizabeth. He ended up marrying six wives. He never really got that son. At the end of the day, when he died, he was succeeded by Elizabeth, the daughter. This throne that I occupy today is not a dynasty. So anybody could uh, take it. This is why I'm not particularly keen on taking a second wife. So I can handle the situation.
Mm. 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 Thank you, my love. Uh -huh. You said there's something you want to tell me. Yes, my king. Mm. It's about the dream I had last night. Dream? So what about the dream? Our son married January. It was a beautiful location. Very colorful. Mm. Uh, a bad dream. My king, how? Greetings, Anna, you know. <laughs> Greetings, Susan. I hope it's my just to see Yes, yeah, she's right in. <laughs> Why is your face like this? <laughs> Mama, I have to get going. So, when are we seeing you again? Uh, Mama, that will be next month though. Next month? Yes, next month. But the next month is fun now. <laughs> <laughs> Ochako Maka. Listen, uh, next month is when I'll get my next leave. You know, go. It's a big room. Eh? Mm -hmm. Chiwendu, your father is back. Papa, ah. what's up? How did I do this to you? Why are you wearing your uniform? The three days leave I will give you is over. I have to get back to the palace and resume it. It's okay, my dear. Age is on my side. <laughs> no. Uh -huh. Let me go and get you your food. Please I do. know you must be hungry. Please do. <laughs> hey. Hey. Oh. Hey. Um. Papa. Come and sit down. <clears throat> um, okay. When you go back to the palace, be a good boy. Don't take anything that doesn't belong to you. Be prayerful. And always remember the family you come from. Hmm? If others are misbehaving, forget about them. Be focused. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Hmm? Yes, sir. Papa, thank you very much. I will not forget the upbringing of us. Okay, my dear. Chiwendu! Mama, where are you now? Ah. Wow, 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 wow. Hey. 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 Papa, no, be dear. <laughs> Papa, I, I have to get going so I can get to the palace on time. Okay, okay. Uh, please, my dear. Hmm? My regards to the king. Ah, no problem. Remember your name. Echazana. Echazana. So, don't forget what I told you. Eh? Papa, I will not forget. Now, Madopanya, oh, you have heard what your father told you. You should get there. So, Mama. Let me see what. Chiwando, don't stay too long, bro. I won't, Mama. Chiwando. Come back quick, oh. Come back quick. Don't stay too long. Eat, hmm? Huh? What impetus? How can a subject flout the orders of a king? Hey! 
and who is flouted my orders? Your Highness, mm -hmm. do you remember that widow Febuche who came here a few days ago? That woman who came here some few days ago to report about land issue. In tears, right? Thank you, Yubei. Mm. She came to my house this morning, crying profusely, refused to be consoled. Igwe, I asked only to be told that her late husband's younger brother is planning to sell that land you want him to keep away from. Hey! And wait. He is planning to sell that same land I warned him against. <laughs> you see, this is what makes the Igwe's job a very difficult one. Huh? If you try to operate like an Igwe by issuing exacting orders, people will turn around and say you're a very wicked man. And if you're too relaxed and you show some understanding, you are portrayed as being a very weak king. Hey, hey, if one can portray three, if portray one as a weak king, cannot do. deal with that idiot. Come on, I'm with you. When did he? Hey. And the boss now goes over and banned the chief. Why you keep your latch over your coat? I will deal with him. I will not kill him. He's one of my subjects. He <laughs> hmm? will not kill him, but that deal in my interest. Deal with him. Come along, you. What I will deal with him. What can I give you? Can I move? Can I get a gun? Who can I get a gun? I can't name me. Your wish is my command. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Nebatarani. Oh, Jesus. Onye batara ni mani no. Ojeso, akwagi batara ni mani no. Ojeso, onye batara ni mani no. Akana muwa akwagi batara ni mani no. Oh Jesus, oh ye batarani manino. Oji miri asanjo, akwagi batarani manino. Oh Jesus, oh ye batarani manino. Nani dia so veji Maria. Nani dia so veji Maria ikeneze wani Nani dia so veji Maria Nani dia so veji Maria ちょうどでるんだなわなもんそう。ちょうどでるんだなわなもんそう。ちょうどでるんだなわなもんそう。ちょうどでるんだなわなもんそう。ちょうどでるんだなわなもんそう。ちょうどでるんだなわなもんそ
I'm warming the soup, oh. Eh? Please wait so that you can eat before you go. You Don't see, worry, now. my darling wife. I'll when I come back. You know, go. Hmm? If you said so. I won't stay too long just to have a few pantries on our land at Amoro Adida. Eh? I will dish your food and keep it on the table inside the parlor so that when you come back, you eat too. Because Chiwendo and I will soon be going to the market. Yes, no Papa. Problem. I'll be leaving now. Okay. Oh, one. Well. Bye bye, Papa. Well, eh? Uh huh. Go on. Oh, yeah. Finish up so that you come and eat. Let's go. Okay, Mama. Most done. Do it all. Okay. Break the firewood so that you have enough to cook. No? Okay. Good boy. Okay, man. My daughter. Oh, thank you, Baba. Oh, thank you. Oh, how did you even ask me? Oh, how was your journey? Papa, see, but stressful. Oh, I can imagine that. Thank you, Papa. <laughs> what of uh, Chiba and Mama? Chiba. Oh, both of them are there at the back. They are cooking. Chiba now helps Mama in the kitchen. What are you not saying? Does he have any choice? <laughs> if he doesn't do that, he will go hungry. <laughs> Let me get you, boy. Hey! I know you. Hey! Stop. Hey! Ah, <laughs> mama, eh? Compassion. Eh, 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 mama. On the contrary, you can't call me that name again. I am now an ex co member. That name is for people who are still serving. Well, I don't want to know. My happiness is that you are done with your youth service. You came back all the way from Nasarawa State. Very beautiful and healthy. <laughs> to God be the glory. Amen. God, I thank you. Amen. Eh? Amen. Go in and freshen up. The food will soon be ready. Okay, Mama. Yeah. Thank you, Mama. Mama. Good afternoon, Mr. Fordy. Good afternoon, Father. What well, your family? We are fine, Father. Everybody's fine. We bless God. Amen. I can see you're in haste. Oh, yes, Father. Yes. All right, let me not disturb you. I'll be seeing you around. Thank you. Okay. And you too, Father. <laughs> hey.
No, you're for the good morning, sir. Good morning, Tito. How are you? I'm fine, thank you, sir. Um, I was actually coming to your house. My house? Yeah. I hope all is well. No, your is well. My father said I should give you this 20,000 naira. That you will need in four cakes of my wine tomorrow for my elder sister's traditional marriage. Is it tomorrow? Yeah, it's tomorrow. Hey! Hey, yeah. You told me about this long ago. But I forgot. In any case, tell him it will be ready first thing tomorrow morning. Good night. Bye bye. Which you went before me, oh? Yeah, I will. Father, how are you? I'm fine, sir. You're welcome, sir. Thank you so much. I want to see His Majesty. Okay, come with me. Thank you. You're welcome, sir. Welcome, Father. <coughs> Thank you so much. Uh, let me tell the king that you're here. Oh, it's okay. Oh, he needs help. Okay, uh, me and Daniel will take him home, okay?
Good day, Your Majesty. Uh -huh, Father, you're welcome. Thank you, sir. Sorry for the delay. Hmm? It's okay. Mm. Good day, my queen. Good day, Father. Thank you so much. Welcome. Yes. <laughs> I came to see Prince Ejike. Is he at home? No, Father. He went to work. I hope there is no problem. No. No. I had a dream. Prince Ejike didn't appear to survive his wedding day. Father, I... I, I had... I had a dream two nights ago. He wedded his wife. You even officiated. In that case, if he comes back, tell him to come and see me. Yes, Father. Meanwhile, let us pray to the Almighty God to avert any impending calamity. In the name of the Father. Greetings to this household! Ah, see ya. How are you? Fine. Good evening. Good evening. Okay, please, please. And stream in our She's inside. I want to see her. Okay, let me call. Okay, thank you. I'll be waiting. Thank you. I saw you on the bike when you were coming back. I tried calling you, but you didn't hear me. You be about one. And I said I must come and see you. I will see you. That's I'm here. Yeah, well done. Thank you. <laughs> Auntie, you are shining. You look so beautiful. Hmm. <laughs> it's obvious that this is not state. It's good on your part. <laughs> <laughs> I would not deny that. How are you now? See me now. I'm fine. I've been managing. Eh? Calm down. <laughs> Don't worry, I got some things for you. Hmm? Really? Mm -hmm. <laughs> thank you, thank it's you. Okay, thank let me go. Thank you very much. Hey! Is he happy? Hurry up, hurry up, let's go. Okay. Who is here? Somebody Who is help here? me. Somebody help me. Somebody help me. Who is here? Let me know. Help me, help me. Help me. Nice. Help me. Nice. Help me. What happened? Uh, uh, it's further from the country. Hi. Hey. Timo. Eh? Nay. How did it happen? Oh. Hey! Oh. Chibo! Mama. Mama. Eh? I think you really have to do something. He's badly injured. Yes. Uh, yes. Oh. Mm. Thank you very much. Oh. Thank you for bringing him home. You're welcome, Mama. We have to go now. Mm. Thank you for your kind gestures. Mm. Mama. Hey. Mama. Mm. What are we going to do now? Mm. Go and call Akumba. Okay. Tell him that your father is a Papa, sorry. Papa, 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 Papa,
so that you're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> good day, Father. Uh, Father, good afternoon. Good day, my princesses. I can see your hands are heavy. <laughs> yes, we went shopping. That's good, that's okay. good. Anyways, I came to see your father. I am on my way going. Uh oh. Okay, let's allow you then. Alright. Thank you. Alright. Well, I believe that whatever it is, you know, um, with prayers, I think we can avert any such calamity. Um, I really don't think that the only son that God gave us will take away from us. Daddy! Good day, Daddy! Good day! Mom, we saw Father Patrick leaving the compound, mm. and from his kindness, he looked worried. He came with a message for the prince. Daddy, what kind of message is this? Well, he said it's between two of them, so he uh, didn't quite tell us what. Dad, I hope he's not in too serious. Well, I sincerely hope so too, um, until the prince sees him, so we know what he told him. Hmm? Oh, by the way, what did you go buy for us? Are you crying? You need to go home. Papa is dead. It's not Papa Megan. <laughs> Papa is dead, brother. He fell down from a palm tree. <laughs> Chimwendo. Brother, leave whatever thing you are doing and start coming home. Mama is crying out. Yeah, who is there? The door is open. You can come. Good day, sir. Yeah, how are you? Fine, sir. Sir, I brought back the documents. Oh, okay. Have you scanned them all? Yeah, I scanned them and also sent them to the company email address as instructed. That's good. That's good. You can keep it there. Go back to your office. Okay, sir. Hello, sweetie. Ah, yeah, honey, I'm back. Wow. So you're at home now? I arrived a few hours ago. Hope you're all right. Yes, of course, I'm fine. You just made my day. Actually, I'm in the office right now, but I promise to see you this evening before I go home, okay? Okay, no trouble. I'll be expecting you. All right, love. Please take good care of yourself. Ah. And make sure you eat very well, okay? I love you. I love you more, my Prince Charming. Mm? <laughs> Bye. All right, I'll see you soon. Uh, wow, I'm very happy. 
my baby is back. Why are you crying? Talk to me. Why are you crying? I just got off the phone with my sister. Okay. She said my father is dead. Your father is dead? Was he sick? She said he fell down from a palm tree. Oh. <sighs> so sorry, brother. Hi. But come on, just calm down, calm down. Have you told the king about this? So you need to tell the king, okay? It's okay. Calm down. Everything will be fine. It's okay. It's okay, brother. I hope you won't be going out this weekend. Oh, no, 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 not at all, not at all. You know, I really need to rest my bones. I had a busy week. Okay? But you know I'm asking. Of course I know. Mm -hmm. And I'll be expecting you this weekend. <laughs> Don't keep me waiting. Don't keep the prince waiting. <laughs> All right, love. Um, I know it's, it's going to be very difficult for you to hear what I'm about to say, but I really need to take my leave. Okay? You, my prince charming. <laughs> mm -hmm. I trust you. I love you. You know, I love you more. I love you more. <laughs> I'll see you soon, okay? Bye. All right, love. Bye-bye. All right, sweet. <laughs> All right. So, I will. All right, love. Be all the glory to you, my Jesus, you the honor. To you, my Jesus. Has he gone? Yes, he has gone. And I'm missing him already. How can you be missing someone who just left? <laughs> Mama, you will not understand. <sighs> I cannot wait. For the day I will become his wife. <laughs> <laughs> and I can't wait for the very day my fellow women will start addressing me as Nemunye Prince. <laughs> and I will be catwalking like Goyenada <laughs> Nyonsi. <laughs> Did you got it. <laughs> hey! Oh! <laughs> Tuku. Yeah. Help me, go. I will. Hey! What about the young man you told me is from the States? The one that reminds you of Michael Jackson. That Daddy. said he, he wants to come and see me. <laughs> When, did, when was the last time you saw him? Well, we spoke yesterday. So, um, he said he will be coming this weekend. Mm. <laughs> I hope he is coming with a lot of money. Of course, mommy. Which is the the problem? My king, I just got off the phone with my sister. My father is dead. 
He fell down from a palm tree. Mm. I'm funny, Lana. Hey! Dear Chadi, you could see Barbu Nenunko. That was his favorite say. Dear Chadi, you could see Barbu Nenunko. My king, I humbly request your permission to go and see my mother and my younger one. It's all right, just before you go. Um, Amaka? Yes, Dad. Go to my bedroom. Bring me the money under my pillow. Okay, Dad. Maki, I'm grateful. God bless you. How was your day? Absolutely hectic. Welcome, bro. Thank you, Ada. Um, let me go upstairs and freshen up. Uh, mm -mm, wait, wait, wait. Father Patrick was here today to look for you. Actually, you know, um, he said there's a message for you. What message, Dad? Uh, it was a little complicated. I think it'll be better you see him. So he tells you what it's all about. Actually, the message is for you. Okay, um, in that case, I'll see him tomorrow morning. No, son. It's very urgent. Go immediately. Okay, Dad. Um, Ada, can yes. I borrow your car? Of course, yes. Thank you. Please help me. Let me yes. help you with this. Oh, Dad. Dad. Very good. Good. Don't stay away for too long. Okay, then. Hello? My brother just take this key quickly and buy the car and take him to somewhere. Okay, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up.
Take this. This piece of paper contains the Bible verses which you need to read to back up these seven days, six to twelve prayer and fasting. Father, is one week not too much? No, it is not. You need to concentrate and do this. It's for your own good. The Lord bless you. So when will I start the fasting? Tomorrow. Start tomorrow. And after the seventh day, you need to come back and let us finalize this prayer in this chapel. Ah, oh, the Lord bless you. I've had you, Father. I need to take my leave now. It's okay. It's okay. May the peace of the Lord be with you. Amen. So, son, what did Father Patrick tell you? Um, he explained the revelation to me, then he gave me this. He gave me this chaplet and this piece of paper. He said, um, I will do six to twelve, seven days fasting and prayer, then use the Bible verses on this paper to back my prayer pointer. Did he tell you where to start? Yes. He said tomorrow morning. Tomorrow. Well, that is good. You need to sleep, son. Yes. Good night. Mm -hmm. All right. Who is there? Coming. supposed to start the fasting today. Oh, I forgot. Oh God. It's okay. I'll start all over tomorrow morning. Oh no. Who again? The door is open. Okay. Big bro. Big bro. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> Why are you girls dressed like this? 
Yes, it's workout time. And we have come to call our gym tutor. That's right. So I hope you wouldn't mind flying your tutors to the gym, big bro. Well, um, thank God you girls came earlier. There is no way I would go to the gym after eating. So let me get dressed. Hurry up, let's go. Yeah. <laughs> Mama, it's okay. It's okay, Mama. It's okay. <laughs> Mama, brother, is back. Brother, wake up. Mama, it's okay. It's your mom. You're welcome. Mama, thank you. How was the meeting? Mama, the meeting was fine. Our kinsman said Papa would be buried as soon as possible. Hey! Die! Oh! Oh! Mama, stop crying. Stop crying. I expected you to be happy about the outcome of the meeting. Eh? Happy? Happy when my husband is dead! Mama, it's not what I meant. I mean, you should... It's okay, it's okay. Jai! Oh! <laughs> Jai! Oh! <laughs> Oh, you can't get You're doing good. Keep it up, keep it up. When you get to 250, you stop, okay? okay, okay. Yeah. You have to promise me something. Oh, definitely. I promise you a bottle of cold red wine. Wow, what about me? <laughs> if only you will be faster than that, okay? Try to be faster, then I'll get you on wine as well. Two to four, two to five. Two to you have a call, my friend. A call? Yeah. Ada, excuse me. Okay. Wow. <clears throat> Hello, sweetie. How are you doing? <laughs> Very well, thank you. And you? Where are you? Are you home? I'm at home. I I've been waiting, actually. All right, no trouble. I'll be on my way. You see me soon. Okay, love. Hope to see you soon, okay? Mm -hmm. All right, darling. It's Yaki. Chi boy. Yeah. Uh -huh. In case Mama returns from the market and asks of me, yes. eh? tell her I went to the palace. Okay. Take care of the house. Don't go around causing confusion. Oh. Big bro. How come you never told us you were expecting a visitor? It's someone you both already know, so there's no big deal there, okay? Wait, so... Chinere? Of course. Is she in town? Yeah, she came back yesterday. Wow! As a matter of fact, she's done with her youth service. Can you imagine that? Wow. wow. It's already a year. Wow. That's great news. Well, I can't um, wait to see her. I will have to go fresh, you know, you know what I mean? Yeah. My sweetheart is on her way to see me. <laughs> Bro! I'll see you guys later, okay? And keep it up. Please Eat remember lots. what you say. Of you course, mean. definitely. One, one bottle of cold red wine. Ooh, and my chocolate. Chocolate, excess of everything is bad. Oh, okay, I'll get you later. Just one, just one. Oh, I'll see you guys. Yourself, please. Uh, hey. I'm so tired. I'm so tired. I can't do this. Welcome. Thank you. 
Uh, please, how do I see the prince? Oh, Gadobun will take you to him. You mean the guard over there? He says you should take me to the prince. Okay, follow me. Please make yourself comfortable while I inform the prince of your presence. Thank you. Am I seeing? Your Majesty. Jenny how are you? Hi, thank you. Oh, how are you? Very well, thank you. Ah, you sure look well. It's written all over you. <laughs> thank you so much, Your Majesty. You were looking really young and prettier too. Oh. My evergreen queen. <laughs> thank you for the compliment. Um, does the prince know you are here? Yes, the guard went to inform him. Oh, okay. I will excuse you then. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Mm. Has it been long you came? Not quite. Okay. And um, what about my gossip mates? Oh, my sisters. Mm -hmm. They should be outside. If you don't mind, can I go see them? Of course. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> she got new arrivals. Wow. Oh, good. I love this. I love them. Let me see. Let me see. Oh my. Do you like that? Good. You say like. Like is an understatement. I love this. Can you imagine myself in this dress? Like, Please let me do my selection like, now. Let me. Wait, wait, wait. Let me see. Let me just see the one. I love this. Wow, Chief. Oh my God. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Wow, babe. You look so beautiful. <laughs> wow. <laughs> this Nasarawa state really nourished your body. Exactly wow. what I was about to say. So like, it's really obvious you enjoy serving there. <laughs> Not really, but they have lots of nice people there. <laughs> excuse me, girls. Excuse me, girls. Um, I am jealous right now. My fiancé actually came here to spend some quality time with me, but you both ain't helping it. Uh, Omar, get us two extra glasses. My love, please come. <laughs> Sit on my lap. <laughs> <laughs> Someone should remember he's on seven days fasting and prayer. Seven days fasting and prayers. Who? Babe, hmm? is it you? No, 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 don't mind her. They are jealous. Both of them are jealous. My own, no one should corrupt me here. <laughs> okay, let me just use your glasses. And because he was a very good person, I decided that we'll hold this meeting so we can decide on when to go and see the family and then what to give to the family. Afrodile was a very nice person. He was my friend and um, I wanted to decide on how and when to visit the family because they must feel our presence. We all attended the same Umopo primary school. Igwe, he was a very good footballer. Mm. Your Majesty. Ofadile was a very good man. He could crack people's ribs with his jokes. 
More importantly, he was a very good Christian. Hi. Your Majesty, mm -hmm. the family of Ofodile expects a lot from us. Because um, Ofodile was the generous man when he was alive. Therefore, uh, Your Majesty. Mm. Your Majesty, I suggest you are granted it. Because Ofodile was a man who, who did not joke with date and time. So when do we go to visit the family? Yeah, Your Majesty, what if we visit them this weekend? Is it is weekend agreeable to you? Yes. Yes. I'm going to go to the house. 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 I'm going to go can you even be a kid who never knew how to play the guitar or for the hill? Hmm. Oh yeah, man. We want to get more money. Boy, I'm a rich guy. You know, I'm going to charge the money. I'm going to get more money. Because we're the wine tapper. Any time we sat down to discuss, his favorite proverb would be, "Igwe." Do each other corresponding So we'll go there with a cow, um, two bags of rice, and whatever amount of money any of you kids are giving to me. That's okay. That's okay. Yeah. That's okay. We are here to console with this family about the death of your husband and your father. We know what it means to lose a dearly one. Only those who have loved and lost can tell the agonies of a party without farewell. Decat, my dear. No, 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 don't do that. Don't do that. Don't cry. Uh, 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 if one more catch you say that, eh? You and your family should be giving this. Ah, thank you. The cat. Thank you. For catch. In the same vein, from We Council of Elders. Hey, my elders. The cat. I'm grateful. Thank you. Ah, I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't get it. No, 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 no. Not to worry at all. Yeah, we are leaving almost evening yeah. because we have a very important meeting this evening. Maybe yes. we will not take No, next time, some other time. Next time. HSL, you are now a man. Take care of your mother and take care of yourself. Be comforted. Look at this. 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 Look at
O si si ti bu lo le ka yo bu bu. Mi ni ni lo le no ka yo bu. O bu bu lo le no si na ti. Ga me bu na mo. O bu bu na do do bu na mo. Lord Jesus, you are the author and finisher of my faith. I commit my family and my destiny into your hands. I ask that you protect us and direct my footsteps. Give me the strength to cater for my mother and my younger sister. I can't do this on my own, not without your strength, Lord. All this I ask through Christ, my Lord. Amen. my son mama there's something i've been meaning to ask to you mama what is it it's about your late father's business wouldn't you like to inherit it i mean to continue from where he stopped I'm saying this because we only make money from what your sister and I get from the farm. And the only get paid at the end of every month, which is not encouraging. So what you need now is something that you will be doing that will fetch you money every day. Hmm? Mama. <coughs> Mama, you are right. I've not given it a thought, but I think you have a point. Of course I do. Because I know for sure that your late father's customers, they will patronize you. Okay. Yes, they will. Mm. Mama, see what happened. Huh? I'll go to the palace mm. and tell them that I'm resigning. <laughs> mm -hmm. And also to get my last month's salary. That's right. Are you happy now? Oh, the woman. Are you happy? That is right. That's right. Mm -hmm. But Prodao mm -hmm. left for me. I prefer your job and position in the palace. So Papa's winds up in business. At least you're one of his closest guards. What are you insinuating? You shouldn't resign. I should not resign. Eh, I told you to Give me. Mama, can you give me? Hey! Bet you pull over. My king, I've come with my mother and my sister to thank you for the help and succor you give to us when my father died. My king, we thank you. Yes. My king, we have come to thank you for all you did for us, for your kind gesture. Thank you. My king, we really do. No, 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 no. Thank you, my king. Thank you, my king. And, uh, my king, I also want to use this medium to say something to you. I don't know how to say this, my king. I wish to resign. What? Yes, my king. I 
wish to switch over to my late father's line of business to enable me to take care of my mother and my sister. How much do I pay you monthly? You pay me 25,000 naira, I think. 25,000. Now that you have become the head of your father's family, um, that means more responsibilities for you. Yes, my king. All right, I... I will add another 50,000 naira to your monthly salary so that you will be paid 75,000 naira monthly. My king. Hey. Hey. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Nibu. Thank you, Yobad. Thank you, Yobad. Your father was a very nice person. Stay, stay, stay. stay. Hey. Hey. Um, as you go out, you will find um, some tubers of yam bound together and a very big he goat. Huh? You can take those ones home too. Okay. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Your Highness. Thank you, Your Highness. Thank you. It's all right. Thank you, my king. Right. You will live long, my king. Thank you. Yes, Your Highness. Thank you so much. You will live long, sir. Hey. Thank you, my king. Hi. Thank you. Indeed, you are a king with a heart of gold. All right, it's okay. Don't worry, it's all right. It's okay. Dalu, okay? Dalu, okay? Okay. In his calls. Oh, does he mean he has forgotten that we'll be rounding up this prayer and fasting today? Huh? Oh. Oh, Prince, no, we don't need to do this. For you. That's your father's dream. Tell me, Dad. <laughs> your Majesty, no? why did you refuse to eat my food? Mm. Should I actually tell you everything? I'm the king, you know. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Hello, son. Uh, I'm not the person who the phone. I need to talk to <laughs> Who is this? And how did you get my son's phone? The person who the phone. One hit a road driver. You just jam and ride and I just hit and go. What? Like this, like this. I'll just kind of go uh, make you want me to for sharing. <laughs> did you get... Did you get an accident? Oh, my gosh. Where is this? 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 Where is
Let me rehearse it. Chi boy, Bia, Bia, what is it? Eh? Who is pursuing you? She said there is fire on the mountain. How do you mean? Bad news. The place was knocked down this afternoon by a hit around driver. Eh? I'm telling you. Where? Where now? Answer me. Where? I don't know. I, I forgot to ask the person that shared the news with me. God. Yes. Yes. What is his name? Uh, Prince AJK. Prince AJK. Yes. Are you all his Yes. 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 Okay, you're his mother. Yes. Okay. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank, Thank you. 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 So this is how the castle I've been building in the air collapsed. All my dreams of becoming the father-in-law to the prince have been wiped off within a twinkle of an eye. My lovely daughter has been crying out her eyeballs because of the prince's death. Huh? What a great loss. May his gentle soul rest in peace. Are you all right? Um, uh, I'm fine. No, I don't think so. I've been observing your mood. You call me a baruba case. I have told you I'm fine. Or do you have any ear problems? No, I don't have any ear problem. Well, I've dished out your food. Should I bring it here? I am not hungry. Keep it there. You are not hungry. I said you have ear problems. I am not hungry. Keep it there. 
Naya ya de sekwa no. Ba ne sekwa si sebe. Ane se si sebe. Oh. O ka no. Ah. If you leave me na ka po. Abia gari ma. Prince Ejike's poster. It is so uh, chai. 30 years. Yeah. Hmm. This thing called debt is very wicked and annoying. Uh uh. My sister, I confirmed it the moment I lost my father. See, eh? If I were God, I won't allow debt to be killing young, young people at all. At least 95 years and above can die, not 30 and below. Eh? It's quite unfortunate that you are not God and would never be. Nico, let's go. Aina! Today, my king. Today, my queen. Hi. Hi. Is it going to be Yes, it's inside, sir. Get even now, no, 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 the only son I have who is supposed to be the heir to this throne is, uh, is dead. So you mean to tell me that the driver was not caught? No, he ran away. He ran away. It's a terrible situation. <sighs> we flew into the country yesterday and heard what happened. So we decided to come and sympathize with you. Thanks for caring. Thanks for sympathy. God will strengthen you. Thank you very much. No. Mm. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very Thank you very much. Thank you Oh, oh. 
You've been crying since I came here. What happened has happened. I I know you love the prince so much. I can I can <coughs> feel your pains now. <sighs> but God knows the best, Auntie Chi. Please stop crying. <sighs> <sighs> Your Majesty, I understand the trauma that this family is passing through right now. But we should not allow the past to bring us backwards. Prince EGK has been buried. Please, take heart. What happened should not make you question God. For he is the giver of life and can take it back whenever he wants. He was our only son, Father. <laughs> yeah, I know. But he is God of knowledge, and by him all actions are weighed. It is possible he has much more goodies in stock for this family. Let us pray for the repose of the soul of our brother, Prince EGK, and other departed souls. In the name of the Father, of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. O Lord of mercy, Welcome all of you. Um, you must be wondering why I decided to assemble you at such short notice. You know that the death of my son has created a gap in the organogram of our company. And I require to replace him so that um, the administrative meal does not get congested. So my daughter here is going to take the place of my son as the new administration manager. My son, of course, was a man, and men are more tolerant when it comes to administration than women. So I want to appeal to all of you to bear with her. She's likely to make a lot of mistakes as she goes along. But when she stumbles, don't deride her by laughing. No. If you cannot tell her directly that this is not how we do it here, walk up to me and say, Boss, we think she would have done it better this way. So, my daughter? She's a girl, but she's a very docile one. She's always willing to learn. So I believe that with your kind cooperation, she will master the ropes before too long. I hope I'm right. Yes, 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 yes. <clears throat> Good. Would you like to say anything? Yes, Dad. Mm -hmm. Good day, all. Good day, my princess. My dad has said it all. Cooperation is the factor in every organization. 
And that is what we need to achieve excellence in the company. Thank you very much. You're welcome, Mr. Chairman. Hey, wait, wait, let me test it. Test it. You are taking three cups until you are still testing. Why are you bothering? Oh, no. Can I wear? We call this thing, this type of wine, an you. <laughs> Let him confirm. I want him to confirm. Thomas, <laughs> what? Hey! This is not that water, that type of thing you take over there and call it drink. See, drink. Obridi Kakaran. He's damasin. Who am I? Can't do it all. Eh, eh, you buy no. Who watch it? I can. I call on you. Obi Onya Ibiya. I am counting on both of you as my allies. Oh no. Don't worry yourself. We will instigate the plan as agreed. Then good. Uh, no, Jesus. No, no. You have to inform other cabinet members about the meeting. <laughs> oh no. He must go and yambo. That's all right. I will do as you said. Oh no. Right. Umpua. 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 I was just coming from the house. Ichio Soji, 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 Ichio Bobby, no, 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 no. Mm, you went to my house. Yes, yes. I was just coming from your house. Oh, the one, my whole police were. No, no problem. Just oh, no, who asked me to inform all the cabinet members that I'll be having a meeting in U.S. Palace tomorrow. Uh, meeting tomorrow? Yes, yes. But the, did he tell you the time? Yeah, he said 10 a.m. 10 a.m. In quarter two? Yes. Oh, oh, didn't matter. Not so bad there. No problem. No problem. I have had you. Okay. Then I will see you there. Okay, no problem. <laughs> visit because I mean it's this is unscheduled. Your Majesty, we came to know how you are coping. Because we have not met since this, the death of your son, Prince Ejik. <clears throat> um, your Majesty, you know in our tradition a son succeeds the father. And now that your son is no more <clears throat> What are your plans or the next move in getting him succeeds you on the throne? Thank you. Uh, <laughs> what he's trying to say is that it's uh, that you have to marry a young lady, a young girl who will bear us a son, who will ascend the throne when you might have joined our ancestors, please. Thank you very much. Um, I have heard you. Your Majesty, so you will give it a thought. I have heard you. <laughs> Thank you, Puka, my friend. Yes. What is your take on the suggestion of nowhere and the chair made to the king at the meeting? That was a very good suggestion. If it works out perfectly, it will give the king another hair apparent. You all just focused on the positive aspect of it. Forgetting that the queen may not be happy if her husband marries a second wife. If I may say, 
the queen has no choice into this matter. The queen can no longer be a son to the king. The queen has had to grow the age of conceiving. The throne is at stake. Anyway, our king is a wise man. Besides, he's here to say yes to the suggestion. Exactly. Let us keep our fingers across, waiting for the next day you call us the king. This is left for him. For him alone. And we see. I assemble you here today because I have information to part to you which I know have been itching your ears for a very long time. <clears throat> uh, your Majesty, we are listening. You know, the last time you were here, you suggested I take a second wife so that we'll have an heir to the throne. Yes, I've considered it and I don't think I require a second wife, all in the name of getting a, an heir to the throne. You are the king, Your Majesty. You can marry as many wives as you want. I know my rights as the king. But you see, going to marry a second wife will conflict with my Christian faith. I'm a Roman Catholic Christian, and I do not intend to take a second wife. Uh, 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 Your Majesty, we only suggested that you take a second wife yes. for the obvious reason of someone who will succeed you. Yes. Mm -hmm. All right. Um, who succeeds me should actually not be a problem to any of you. I am the Igwe. Yes. I might just decide that one of you will succeed me. <laughs> <laughs> well, what are the other person? We can wait. I am the closest friend to the Igwe. And don't know. <laughs> How soon will that be, please? How soon? Eh? Let's wait and see. Could you just me as you know? Don't choose me as you know. Mm -hmm. information to disclose to you. Classified information? Okay. We are alone. Talk to me. Mother, do you know the elders are persuading dad to take a second wife that would bear him a son? What? Who told you that? No one. I eavesdropped on the conversation in the throne room. But unfortunately to them, dad didn't agree to that. He did not? He refused bluntly, telling them that it's against his Christian faith. It's okay. I'll go and see your father right away. Wait, I think you should do that. Excuse me. Plans are working out well, but um, you know, how did you know that the king would turn down our suggestion of getting a second wife? Are you a prophet? 
Igwe is a man I know very well. He's a close friend of mine. I don't really think he meant what he said about giving out the kingship to any of us after his reign. I don't think so. Wow. This indicates that you are yet to understand Igwe. Igwe Dr. Clifford Omokachie is a man of his words, a man of character, a man who will never go back on his words. His yes is capital, yes, and his no is capital, no. What if he doesn't give the kingship to any of us? Igwe has no son any longer, you know. He made it clear to all of us, he boldly stated it in the palace, that taking a second one will be against his Christian faith. You are talking of not, not his, uh, relieving the, uh, relinquishing the throne. Okay, oh, what you want to tell me that Igwe will be buried with the throne, is it? No, 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 no. I am saying that he may have a rethink of the suggestion and decide to take second wife for the sake of the truth. I think my best suggestion would be when we get to the river, we know how to cross the street. Mm -hmm. Meanwhile, let us keep our fingers crossed. Okay. Okay. Uh, let me have my yeah. yeah. You can go. Okay, okay. And you think you We are trying to be careful. When we talk to people, get prepared. Oh, you mean we bury the throne along with the top of then you won't be given out. I should. Won't be given out. My lord. This is true. You look troubled. Yes, I am. I, this is headache. It's getting too constant, but I'm coping with it. I'm sorry, my lord. Thank you. You know. Uneasy lies the head that wears the crown. Yes, because the crown of kings is lined with thorns. <laughs> you know, the elders think I should get married to a second wife so I can get an heir to this throne. But I'm not even thinking about that. You see, we are Roman Catholics and I don't think there's a need for me to take a second wife, no. None whatsoever, no. But my king, that seems to be our only option. If we know we would not be losing this throne, I can't conceive anymore because of age. You see, this is why I love you very much, mm -hmm. because of your understanding. Very few women would encourage their husbands to take a second wife, but I will not take a second wife, no. You see, taking a second wife is not really a guarantee that I can get an heir to this throne. Remember, Henry VIII broke away from the Catholic Church because he wanted a son after his wife had given him Elizabeth. He ended up marrying six wives. He never really got that son. At the end of the day, when he died, he was succeeded by Elizabeth, the daughter. This throne that I occupy today is not a dynasty. So anybody could uh, take it. This is why I'm not particularly keen on taking a second wife. So I can handle the situation. I can. It's alright. I can handle the situation. You're done already? Yes, my queen. I have placed His Majesty on an intravenous trip. That will help him regain his strength as fast as possible while I hurry to the hospital for his lab test and the diagnosis. Okay. So when will his um, test be ready? Hopefully tomorrow morning. But I'll be back soon to check on the trip. Thank you, Doctor. It's all right. Drive safe. Chinyere. Be mindful of what you say. Don't you know that walls have ears? Mama, I'm very sure of what I said. It was Princess Adobe that told me herself. She even said the brain tumor has gotten to its last stage. Last stage? If it is at the last stage, that means the tumor has been there and he has been keeping things to himself all this while. Hi. Nine. What do you expect him to do? 
nobody broadcasts illness no nye ga no kata buru oya na eku gari nya na ayo na aga ana emi emi Papa? Yes. Are you have a point here? My best friend. I presume you all know about my present health condition. I went for a scan. The scan result is out, and um, I am told by the doctor that I have a brain tumor, and that I have uh, just 13 weeks to live. I think it's just three months or more week. Hmm. That's what the scan says, the scan result. Yes. But Your Majesty, the time they gave you is too short. Three uh, months and one week. Well, that's what the... Scan result says. Your Majesty, does it mean that the brain tumor is not curing? Mm -hmm. Can't you understand simple English? The king says that the thing is on the last stage and nothing, nothing can be done. And you are still asking question. Uh, uh, Your Majesty, have you started experiencing at the last stage a symptom of the brain tumor? Mm, not really. I expect that um, I have constant headache. So. Well, it depends on, on body system. Yeah. With time, other symptoms will show up. Yeah. You know, I have lived my life in such a way that I am not scared of dying. Yeah. I am not. I've lived my life in such a way that when death comes, I'll embrace it. Yeah. Who was it that said it's an inevitable end? It's only in Shakespeare, so. If it comes, I'll take it. It will not be. Your Majesty, you don't have to be discouraged about your illness or the number of days you were told you have to live. If it is not the will of God, nothing will happen to you. Thank you very much, Father. Thank you. The Bible says in the book of Luke chapter 17, verse 6, that if you have faith as little as a grain of mustard seed, that you can tell this mountain, move, and it shall be moved. All you need is faith. Thank you very much, Father. You have uh, been a very dependable friend. And um, I appreciate your concern. Please, thank you very much. Thank you, Father. Thank you so much. Let us pray. In the name of the Father. Tito, mm -hmm. please make this hair to be beautiful. Uh -uh. Trust me now. Have I not been the one doing it for you? I want this one to be more beautiful. Eh, uh -huh. Chingwe, now that I remember. Have you heard the news going around concerning our king? News, uh -huh. Is it the one of him refusing to take a second wife? Yeah. Mbao, that one is an old news now. I'm talking about the current news. Biko, tell me. I learned that the king is going to die in three months' time. Why? Mm. Because he has an injury in his brain. Enjoy your one. And... Talk now, you that always gossip. Talk. Sorry, let me remember what they called it. Uh -huh. They said his brain tumor. And they say he's going to die in three months' time. Huh? How? I don't want anything to happen to him, Mom. Likewise me. He should not die. He's a nice person. I, I don't want him to die too. <sighs> but wait, 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 wait. Who told you? Because my brother works in the palace and he has never said something like this. Actually, somebody told someone who told the person that told me. Hey. Hey. Oh, Tito. Ashiriboku. 
Is it bad I brought you to? Biko, don't give me this one. Papa, I won't tell you anything again. Ah, uh -uh. Biko, mm -hmm. make my hair. Every time I bring you to you, instead of you to be happy, you keep insulting me. Again. Don't even tell me. Nah, bakas. I won't tell you. Ah! You want to talk to me for no more catch yet, hmm? You tell her I'm not killing. You don't want to tell me. 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 You don't Come on, come on. I will see you now. Omokache, you sent for me. You know, because of my state of health, I have decided to bring my Ophala celebration forward. The doctors say I have three months and one week to live, and um, I thought I should uh, celebrate my Ophala before death catches up with me. Uh, uh, but Igwe, you've been in the habit of celebrating your father at the end of each year. Uh, uh, this is only March. Mm. I have decided to do it so that um, I can honor what the doctors told me. They told me how many more days I got on earth. And I thought I might as well celebrate my father. This is why I decided to shift it forward. So, um... I sent for you to tell you, more or less confiding in you, but uh, let the other members of cabinet know that this is what the situation is. Yeah. Your Majesty, your wish will always be my command. Thank you very much. It is a my Yeah, because you know the usual one I think. Make sure not you know you. Eh? What about your daughter? Your Highness. You know she finished some years ago. She has gotten an employment, but she has decided to change her place of employment. I don't know how Rosie. She's no more comfortable with the present place. You never know with women, you know. Whatever she decides to do that will give us some happiness. Let her go ahead and do it. I thank all of you. I decided to summon this meeting to tell you what my official response to the present situation is. We are all here, uh, Your Majesty. You know, I normally perform my annual offala at the end of each year, but I have decided to bring it forward um, because of the present situation. I know that you will understand. Wow, that's a wonderful idea, Your Majesty. Thank you very, very much. Very stressful. Uh, wait, wait, wait. But anyway, my worry is so we take over the throne from you. That is after your reign. I don't know if that has ever crossed your mind. It has. You see, I live my life one day at a time. And uh, the kind of philosophy that I operate I do not believe in Russian things. I feel that when we get to the bridge, we cross it. <laughs> <laughs> really? I wonder who will be the lucky man. I don't see why you should be in such a hurry to know who takes over from me. <laughs> As our people always say, Um... Hello, Your Highness. Tell the town crier I would like to see him. Yes, Your Highness.
Um, well, there's nothing else to discuss, but don't rush off yet. Thank you, sir. Martin. You can never have a major chair with an old tooth. Hmm? me. But the point you are me. Hey! Another one, I didn't know. Oh no! 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 I uh, will be there on fellow ladies. Oh, thank you very much. I, I think I should see. be on my way now. No, why don't we go inside? Let me give you something. Put it some other time. Well, if you say so. Mm -hmm. yeah. My regards to your family. Oh, oh no, okay. <laughs> okay, Chuku. Yeah. Okay, Chuku. Okay, Chuku. Come, come. Honestly speaking, I am very happy. My plans are coming true. Do you know that Igwe himself indirectly announced me as his successor today? Really? Papa, you don't mean it? Yes. He told everybody present that his successor was very obvious. And who else, if not me? Remember, I am the traditional prime minister of the St. Clair and the closest friend to the Igwe. And very soon, I'll be embracing the kingship of the noble kingdom. <laughs> <laughs> Papa, when that happens, I will be the crown prince. Automatically, now, Kaki Jumayoku, the prince and the princess. <laughs> <laughs> well, it is a good thing. Yes. If it works out. Why wouldn't it work out? Uh -huh. Or are you an enemy of progress? No. Uh -uh. <laughs> Nobody speaks out sweet things when forced into his or her mouth. Exactly. Eh? Oh, no. <laughs> You must be here by now. What is it? Kratos. I hope that place is not for me. Remember, it's for me. You can't be asking me the way about someone we have been waiting for. People of Umoku! Listen to this very important announcement. Our Igwe, His Royal Majesty, Dr. Clifford Omokachie, has instructed me to tell you that on the 25th of this very month comes his of Allah day. Everybody is important because he has a very special thing to tell you. Man doesn't want to go on to the day. Well, you should have told us yesterday that we're all coming here to waste our time waiting for him. <laughs> Somebody is complaining already. Guy knows why. He kept us waiting. We have been here close to two hours. He said two hours. More than two hours. Now, please wait. 
Hello. Uh, greetings. What? Wait, what is going on? What's happening here? Iche, we went to your house. Your wife told us you already left. So we followed you. Uh -huh. yes. All of you? Yes. yes. Followed yes. me? Yes. 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 We followed you to tell you that you choose the money and not the Bible. Uh -huh. yes. No, now. All of you come up money conscious like that to choose money instead of Bible. Uh, Iche, Iche, please, uh, you can choose the Bible or whatever thing you want to choose. As for me, I want the money. Uh, uh, yeah, I call my father. I live in India. We want the money, not buy money. Give on a call money here. So, what are you telling all of you need money? So, mm, only me will choose Bible as a father. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. I have, I have had you, I have had you. Come to my house by this evening. I will write down your names and I will distribute the money. It's a dream. Hi. Oh no. Was Grand the king? Hey. But why will he choose Ichi Wajide? As his own know, instead of me. Hey, this is a revelation of what will happen when Ono becomes the king. Hey, no, I must do something. I must do something because Ichi Wajide will never be the next Ono while I'm alive. Let's do something fast. Who's that? Who goes there just up there? Who are you? Hello, it's me, Ichiya Odumba. I don't know. Why are you out at this time of the night? Oh no, I came to see you. And it's very important. That is why I took the risk of coming this night. Odumba, let me understand. I hope your family members are alright. I hope all is well. Mm. I will say yes. Because all is well on your own side. But to my side, the answer is no. I'm getting confused. I don't understand. I saw you in my dream this night. As you succeeded the king. And he crowned you. <laughs> Look. That might be a surprise to you. But to me, it's not surprising at all. Because I knew right from the one that I would succeed the king. <laughs> uh, no. Yes. That is not the point. That is not the point. What's the point then? The point is that you were asked to pick one of the cabinet members, as you all know, and you excitedly picked Ishii Wajide instead of me. <laughs> Zumba, you never see some mess me. I never knew it could be so funny. <laughs> Probably. That's why you've come to my place. To beg me to make you my own. Exactly. <laughs> eh? 
and I, 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 I wouldn't mind bribing you. No, 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 no. Just keep that bribe to yourself. The very fact that you've taken the risk of coming to my place by this time of the night. Ah, it's enough reason for me to make you my own. Eh? Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> you make a good king. No, no. You don't have to remind me because if you look at me, kingship is written all over me. Mama. And I know how to treat my subjects very well. You don't need to worry yourself about that. <laughs> about you know who you've mentioned, it is yours. So don't worry, so just go home. Oh no, Igwe! Oh no, Igwe! Oh no, Igwe! Igwe, it's all right. Are you a job ago? Napa? You now have you break. You want to see what more? Oh, for times what I tell her. Oh, Hey, I don't, just, I don't know what is holding me from from dropping dead this moment, so that I will ascend the throne immediately. Oh, I was thinking of shaving myself. That, that would have been a very big mistake of my heart. I would allow this grey hair to keep on growing. It would be very befitting. That's a new way. <laughs> I think the best thing I'll start doing that is parading myself out of the new way. Or tan suit. Or tan chara. You go to see what more? That's me. And when I'll be going about in the city, I'll be waving to people. If I say, oh, mom, the one. I give it to myself, I say, if we, moha. If we, moha. If we, moha. Ha, 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 ha,
will succeed. Yes, indeed. Something has happened in the land. Something unimaginable. Something so terrible. The only hope of the people is gone. So the people are wondering what's to be done. There's confusion. There could be commotion. Unless something is done. Feel the vacuum in the kingdom. It will require great wisdom to avoid trouble and things. Getting out of hand will take wisdom to avoid commotion and the wrong decision in the kingdom. It will take great wisdom. Only the king can take. He looks absolutely beautiful. Just like a beautiful. You can say that again. Considering that the length of this dress is really long, anytime we're going out, you have to hold the tail of the dress for me. I can even start carrying it. No, 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 no. Oh, Mama. Lola. Tell me. How do I look? Chinere. Mama? This thing you and your father are doing is not good. At least you people should have allowed Igwe Mokachi to die before you start parading yourself as princess. My hands are out of it. Mama. Calm down. Last, last, you'll be the one enjoying all of this. So. Trust me. Calm down. <laughs> ah. Jesus. A kingdom where the wise king will succeed. Take this food to your inside. With the fear of God and wisdom, oh, yeah. oh, he will lead. He will make the right decisions. Oh, you know, and take the, the right actions. You are. Yeah. The kingdom with the wise Who is that? Come to the backyard. Okay. Yes, indeed. Something has happened in the life. Chilo, please put that pot on the fire, please. Chilo. Mama Dalu. Ah, what's it up? Mama. Welcome. How are you? I'm fine, Mama. Speak to me. Aspa. Chilo. You will not believe who I saw while coming down to your house. Who you saw? I saw Ono and his daughter parading themselves around the village as the new king and the princess. Yay! Oh, what? Yes, to Mama. And he even has a bodyguard. Bodyguard? Eh? Who is the person? Do you know him? Um, mm. Wozo. He late my days in one son. That is him. Chere Kwao. Chere. The one that worked at the city as a bouncer. But Mama, Onyawa. He now works as Ono Wu's dog. Yay! Hmm. Wonders are never No, but I am. Hey! But he told the news broadcaster. I could not believe my eyes. If you see the princess as she was talking. Like this. Huh? Like this. The hey! Of the people is gone. So the people are wondering what's to be done. There's confusion. There could be commotion. Unless something is done. Feel the vacuum. In the kingdom, it will require great wisdom to avoid trouble and things. Getting out of hand will take wisdom to avoid commotion and the wrong decision in the kingdom. It will take great wisdom. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> this is oh, no, no. No, not even you, youths. I never plan to, I mean, correct the youths. What's the problem with you? Uh, no, no. I, we don't understand. They are the way again. So it had not occurred to you at all that I am the next king to the throne of this kingdom. It will have a few days to die. Hey, hey, hey. But now you, the king is here to announce who will succeed him. Uh -huh. 
So, it never occurred to you that I'll be the next person to succeed you way, as or no one the closest friend to you way. Now, now, listen. Since you people have refused to correct yourselves, <laughs> I have no option than to get three of you banished. <laughs> hey, 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 no, no, no. Sorry, Your Majesty. Sorry, Your Majesty. Yes, sorry, yes, please. please forgive us. Forgive us. Please. Yes, and um, you equally have to apologize for not addressing me properly as okay. the princess. Put your hands down. Hurry up. Sorry, my princess. Sorry. What is going on here? Ah, welcome, my dear. Uh, you boys, you can go. Thank you, Majesty. Thank you. God bless you. <laughs> Oh no, did I just hear them call you your majesty? <laughs> Do you have any auditory problem? You heard them well. That I heard them very well? This is blasphemy. Our king is still alive and he has not announced you as his successor. So why all this nonsense? Oh no. I don't know what your problem is. If you are in your right thinking senses, me? You should be able to know that uh, I am the closest person to Iwe. Or know who of this kingdom. And by implication of that, I am the next king of this great kingdom. Oh no. Are you with your senses at all? Is your dog again, ma? Is your face sick here? No, no, no. Let me, let me see. Let me tell you something. I know that madness runs in your family's vein. Still runs in you. No problem. Really? If not because you're a member of the Igwe's cabinet, mm -hmm. I would have dealt with this mm -hmm. idiot. I know you. But you never, you won't go unpunished. Mozo, do your work. Yes, sir. You can't do anything. Oh, get it, man. Eh? Oh, get it, man. Get it. Oh, get it. It's here. I'm an end of this coming in. They're coming in, right? I'm not sure. They're coming in, right? Come on, 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 come I want you to get the biggest ram you find in the market. Hmm? Yes, my king. I promised the bishop I was going to get him the biggest ram for the harvest Thanksgiving and bazaar. Hmm? Yes, my king. I don't want to disappoint him. Okay. So where do you think we can get a very big ram? My king, I hmm. should be able to find one at the AK market. Mm -hmm. But if I fail to see one there, or do we will definitely have one. Hey. <laughs> Igwe Omoka <laughs> change self. Also, what you are the Gigi Bele? Igwe himself. No. Igwe Omoka change himself. Yadu. Igwe. No. Igwe the way. Yadu. Adam Igwe. Kia makandebe. I know me and Kai Waba Tetu or the Wabuma. He bought them. Igwe. Can you imagine that Onowo and his daughter have been parading the entire village, posing as king and princess, even two people, to call them by such names? I don't know what they have heard of it. Well, I have not, but I'm not surprised. Um, I know he's entitled to his pet ambitions. There's nothing wrong with that. Let him go ahead. That's why he's a human being. So there's nothing to worry about. Hmm? I see that you're in such a terrible hurry from the way you sound. You didn't even sit down. So wait, wait, wait. Get you done. Put in your pocket. Ibe, mm. you want me alone? Oh, wait, you need to me. Mm. Ibe, mm. you are mama. Oh, no, you are not going to get to the church. You are going to get to the church. Ibe, you are going to get to the If only A.G.K. your brother was alive. I'm sure your father wouldn't have shared his wealth among the entire kingdom. But no, we are alive. For Christ's sake, that wealth is our inheritance and not the other way around. Your father is filled with wisdom. I'm sure that for whatever reason he did what he did, it is in our best interest. We pray so. Greetings, Your Majesty. Greetings, my princess. Greetings, Aloma. What is it? The king demands the presence of Princess Adobe. Hmm. I'll be right back.
Mother, do you know why Dad sent for Ada? No. Why do you ask? The way you smiled. Ah. It, it was just a smile, Jamaka. Okay, Ada. Hmm? Welcome. Please sit down. Glad you sent for me. Mm, I did. If God sends you a man today to marry you, would you would you marry him? Yes, I will. But Dad, how will I know he's been sent to me by God Almighty? Good. Good question. Mm. You know, God works in mysterious ways. He will prepare the circumstances for you so that when the man comes, the moment you see him, you'll fall in love with him, and he too will fall in love with you. That is the way God works, right? And um, it'll be a perfect match. So, let me hear you <laughs> emphasize it. Mm? I will. <laughs> Good. That's my daughter. Dad, why the question? Mm -mm, don't worry about why I'm asking the question. Just uh, the answer. I'm satisfied with the answer. Mm -hmm. It's in the positive, right? Yes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's my daughter. A kingdom with a wise king will succeed. With the fear of God and wisdom, he will lead. He will make the right decisions. Oh, you and take the right yeah, you know. Hey, you're dressed already. Yes, yeah, so your dress is beautiful. Really? Yes. Thank you. Yours is fine too. Thank you. Mama, good morning. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. okay. Mama, how are you? I'm fine, Mama. Have your parents gone to the palace? Eh. Uh Aha, -huh. let's go then. Come on, go, go, go. People is gone. So the people are wondering what's to be done. There's confusion. There could be commotion. Unless something is done. Feel the vacuum in the kingdom. It will require great wisdom to avoid trouble and things getting out of hand. We'll take wisdom to avoid.
today is a very important day in the history of our community because today I will elect my successor, the successor to the throne, Aumu Uta, had instructed members of my cabinet to go and confer with pulling their clan, all those who make up their clan, and find out from them what they would rather settle for, money or the Bible. As you all know, I am a Christian Igwe, a Roman Catholic Christian Igwe, and I believe very much in the Bible. I believe in supplication. I believe very much in prayer. So whatever I do, I place God first, but we may not all be thinking along the same line. So I would like to know precisely what the various clans have agreed with those who represent them. <laughs> Your Majesty, mm -hmm. if my people said money, don't left for me, I wouldn't have said money. But since said the majority is there, <laughs> I have no option than to follow them. So you settled for money? Uh, uh, yes, yes, Your Majesty. Good. Authority. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Really, I persuaded my people to accept the Bible, but they said no, that they want money. <laughs> good. And you join them, right? Good, good. I have good. no option. Good, good. <laughs> that was Zumba. <laughs> Ogo Jimba. Zumba. Ogo Jimba. Eh. Uh, Your Majesty, hmm? uh, we want a gigwe. Big money. <laughs> Uh, yes, you have not disappointed my assessment of you. So uh, you're perfectly in order. Looking at you, another you settle for money, which is good, good. Uh, <laughs> uh, the Gabosog and the people of my community, they have concluded that we want money. <laughs> There is absolutely nothing wrong in settling for money. So I'm not blaming any of you, right? I did not exclude members of my household from the lottery. Money or the Bible. You go want money. 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 Good. Yes. Um, you? Your Majesty, money. You? Igwe. Igwe is Igwe is money. Good. Uh, it is there. My king. Mm -hmm. And you? My, my king, I choose the Bible. What do I come up here, Noto? Wait, wait, wait. It is there. I've chosen the Bible. He is the only person here who has settled for the Bible. Right? Really? It is there. And read out whatever you find inside that Bible. My king, there are two pieces of paper. The first one is a check of 100 million naira. The second one is more like a will, my king. Read it, read it, come on. I, King Dr. Clifford Omokache, confidently will my throne 
to whoever picks up this Bible. If it be a female, she will be adequately compensated. But if it be a male, he will be crowned the Prince of Umobu Kingdom. And he will marry my daughter, Princess Adobe, and inherit my throne when I join my ancestors. You are now the crown prince. And you will marry my daughter. You are automatically the successor to this throne. And when the good Lord eventually decides I must join my ancestors, you will take over this throne. Dad is such a wise man. Now I know why he asked me if I would agree to marry a man if he's been chosen for me by God Almighty. <laughs> Well, Ichizuna is handsome and hard-working young man. He would make a good husband and a good king. <laughs> then I look at these people who make up members of my cabinet. After I lost my son, who was the sole heir to this throne, members of my cabinet began to angle to take over the throne. One person particularly was wishing the good Lord to speed up my death so he can take over. And that person is the Onowu himself. Dad, my son, you're welcome. I invited you here to give you a fake assignment. <laughs> May not be very easy for you to understand, but I'll tell you how and why. As you are aware, this is not the best of times for my family. I just lost my son, the heir to this throne, and um, I have observed that members of my cabinet have gotten into little conspiracies to take over this throne because according to them, I have nobody to succeed me. Some of them wish me dead. I must be honest with you. This traditional stool which I occupy today is not hereditary because it's not a dynasty, no. It is rotational. So a successor can come from any part of this community. But you see, I want to encourage them into some false sense of accomplishment. I want to massage their ambition so they can continue with that kind of illusion until I come up with the surprise I have for the entire community. So I will pretend to be ill, terminally ill. You alone will know that nothing, repeat, nothing is wrong with me but you will come in occasionally to look me up examine me prescribe some placebo for me to take and then tell my family that i am inching on all hope is not lost we'll keep doing that until i say all right doc on so so and so day i will reveal the plan that i have for this community that's all I would want you to do, nothing else. It costs you nothing. And me, nothing. Except that it helps to grow the confidence we have in each other, that is all. We know that this is a grand plan to find out the conspirators within my cabinet. They will think that before too long I will join my ancestors so it will encourage them to do some illusion of grandeur and succession. But they will only be fooling themselves. Only two of us know that nothing, repeat, nothing is wrong with me. 
So you, you wear a serious face, just like I will, and we shall see the plan through. Simple. Is that even challenging, is it? No. Your Majesty, mm -hmm. I've heard what you said. Thank you. Ono who pretends affection for me in my presence, and behind me, he prayed that the forces would catalyze my demise. All right, unknown to all of you, I arranged with the doctor to popularize the impression that I am terminally ill. There was nothing wrong with me. Eh? Absolutely nothing. It was all fake to enable me to determine the commitment I have from members of my cabinet. And oh no, you became a total failure, an abysmal disappointment, and a bundle of idiocy. I was expecting that you will care a lot about this kingdom, but no. It's your own personal interest that constituted an obsession and blinded you completely. Now that I know, and you never knew I was ever likely to find out, we do not require somebody like you in our kingdom. You will be banished from this kingdom. And you will never set foot on this kingdom again. So that this would serve as a lesson to all those who knows ambitions that will only at best destroy them. You are banished here and now. So, this is how I lost that throne to a mere palace servant. I want you to know. Let me, let me. You take it. I told you to do this. I told you to do this. Oh no, one now. Oh no, one now. Ambitious man to be the king. Go and be the king. Look at him. Very ambitious man. I want you. After Judas Iscariot betrayed our Lord and lost his position as one of the apostles. Somebody said, let his position another take. Maybe it was our Lord who said it. I don't remember now, but my wife should remember. Our Lord said it, right? Beautiful. Now that you know who is gone, let another his position take. Osoji. Igwe. I'm my next to know. Hey, Igwe! Shideki. Kingdom 
it will require great wisdom to avoid trouble and things getting out of hand will take wisdom to avoid commotion and the wrong decision in the kingdom it will take great wisdom only the king can take this wise decision a kingdom with a wise king will succeed will succeed with the fear of god and wisdom he will lead he will lead he will, lead. He will make the right decision succeed yes indeed some people are plotting and planning to seize the opportunity and achieve their selfish aim they try they will try to do all they can to achieve their selfish needs because of their greed oh what a shame what is the gain chai what a shame what is the gain it might end up in pain and shame mm. but thank god for the wisdom of the king and fair justice he will bring to ensure stability of the kingdom what a great wisdom oh what a king a kingdom with a wise king will succeed with the fear of god and wisdom he will lead he will lead he will lead he will lead he will make the right decisions succeed